Hello everybody, happy Friday and welcome to day five of my Fitness February Challenge. So, Monday we had 50 squats, Tuesday we had a one minute plank, Wednesday we had side leg raises, how long could you do on each leg, yesterday we had 25 lunges on each leg, today we are concentrating on ab crunches. Now the goal for this over the next four weeks is potentially for you to go from an ab crunch to a full sit up. However, for today, we're gonna to take it lower. We're gonna start with your ab crunches. So again, I have to stress, if you are pregnant, okay, do not take part in this exercise today. If you have diastasis recti, which is the muscle separation in the ab muscles, which happens after childbirth, then again, do not take part in this challenge today. OK, please make sure you have got clearance to do any kind of exercise if you are undergoing physio or treatment or anything like that. So ab crunches. This is all about core work. So we are building up the strength in our core. OK, it's important. An ab crunch is a nice way to do it safely and slowly before you start to progress to a full sit up. OK, one thing I have to say is please protect your neck when you do your ab crunches, because I've heard of a few people that have done these before, they get a little bit excited, get a little bit carried away, they fly up into the crunch, and then they hurt their neck and potentially trap a nerve as well. So you're gonna come down to the floor, you're laying on your back, you're gonna have your feet down, you're gonna have your hands to the side of your head, not behind your head. The challenge for today is how many crunches can you do in one minute? So again, time yourself, count how many you do, and as the weeks go on, you can see if you improve. What you do is you have your hands to the side of your head, not behind, as I just said. You bring your shoulder blades and shoulders off the floor, and you are crunching your core. Make sure that you breathe out when you come up into the crunch. So just remember, when you do any kind of rep work, you are breathing out on the hardest part of the rep and breathing in in the easiest part of the rep. Sometimes your brain wants you to go the other way around. So that's the challenge. How many crunches can you do in one minute? Good luck.